So I think I did this like two months ago, or was it three, three to four, three or four months ago? I don't know. I think it was two months ago. I don't know. But I mentioned about some something about like a statues are being uh, beheaded and then not but first off it was like uh like slave owners slave traders and such but it seems like uh that there was that but uh, like they uh, decided to uh, like target Religious statues, so like, so they did that to Jesus, they did that to Jer Mary, they did that to uh, you know, and then back to like, uh, and then so the, the most another one was uh, Sir John A. Macdonald, the uh, first uh, Prime Minister of Canada, 1867, you know. If you're Canadian, uh, you know, you probably know this in your history. It's in our history books. So this, uh, this is what just happened. So, so this weekend, the statue of the Virgin Mary was decapitated outside the Lebanese Catholic Church in Toronto. Like, and... Uh, so this is another attack against the religious community. It's, and so I think enough is enough. So I do not know and understand why people want to this decide to attack the religious community. So, uh, so it would I would understand it if it was like an atheist uh, doing it because like oh I hate your religion and then they did I don't want to believe in the religion and it you know they did that on purpose but in a place like Toronto they're like like. Then like so, so like at least a million uh, people like live in there, and like of all well, people from uh, all races, and all and all the and people who are like there are like people uh, there who are like uh, religious and yeah there are like so many kind of churches like uh, they're like. <clears throat> So I don't know, like, uh, I don't know, like, what, like, that they had to do with, with, uh, with the, Le I'm not too sure even how it has to do with the Lebanon community, but they have not done anything or a racist, uh, like, nobody, so, no. So they should not have been, like, a victim of, you know, targeted like that, no. So in North America, you know, so not just, it was like, not just like a slave, previous uh, slave owners or like slave traders or like maybe like famous people, Winston Churchill, like, uh, who got their like stat statues like torn down or beheaded. And not just like the religious ones too, but <clears throat> so this was reported so it was like reported like months ago by uh the US and the Canadian uh, arm the US army I guess you know you know the and apparently the so I have a half like uh where like you know where they were like you know 
There's a whole bunch of list of names uh, of uh, American American uh, soldiers, uh, many men and women who have uh, fought for America and uh, they have fought for the country and proudly, and they have uh, either they like, come home, come back home, or maybe they died. No, they were remembered, and so. Though know, some people like apparently vandalized the, they, they like smashed it down and so when I like first talked about this topic, uh, I had I said I clearly said though so, so I'm a I'm a theist. I don't believe in the Catholic being a Catholic or like uh or like you know that that stuff or like and then any of believing in a, like a god or something like that but but if, if there I know somebody who is like who believes in the god or maybe they go to they are Catholic they're like the Buddhist Buddhist uh, like confused to Catholic or whatever it's called ah, sorry I'm I'm not an expert with the religions and yeah I know there's a whole bunch of whole bunch of other religions out there uh, and so if someone uh, want, wants to like pray to God like, and such uh, I will not hold it against them and I think it it is uh, their right to uh, like if they want to uh, they can and uh, these stuff you know like stuff like that you know Jesus Virgin Mary you know and uh, and Jesus the Father you know yeah. This statue and, and a whole bunch of any any other religious uh, statue. Uh, I think uh, it is a uh, right to have uh, keep it up. There, so like basically anyone who is of, of uh, any race or any uh, any gender, if they are religious, they should uh, go to church and uh, pray. No, and. I see there is nothing, I don't think there is nothing wrong with with uh, having these uh, religious uh, statues up because it is like a representation of like so if you know like uh, you know that Jesus thing so if I went to Brazil and I saw that Jesus thing, I would like, you know, I'll pay my respects. Someone praying? Like, mm. So if, yeah. yeah there, I know some, uh, I have some, uh, Basically, the rest of my family is uh, religious, so, <laughs> except for my cousins. So I don't have to pray, because I'll let the others do it. So there are like uh, there are like churches for the like the Nazarene. There's for Muslim. There's for Korean. There, there's for like and then there's like uh, most of the, and then there's the churches where the pastor where the priest uh, or pastor is uh, Chinese or yeah and or Presbyterian church or like Anglican church or you know all all kinds of churches yeah. So I'm whenever I've been to a church before, yeah, I've seen like these like uh these uh religious uh, statues and yeah.
is it that much of a big deal just because you're so pissed off about it that you want to be like, torn, torn down or beheaded? If I see a tight statue of Breonna Taylor, and you you know what happened with her, like, you know, she, you know, in possession with drugs. The guy she was with, was not had, had, had drugs, but, yeah, and he really put the blame on, put the blame on her, and then, you know, stuff, stuff went left and right, and then, you know, So it's basically if uh, no his you know this is how I view it. so history is history this is way back then like so if there is like a religious statue like uh erected and it has been it has been there for like uh thousands and uh, thousands of years and like you know like Maybe all this Asian people like, well, like maybe hundreds of years, and uh, they it would like represent, you know, for like di deities or like maybe they you know, like kings and queens and you know, that such. And, uh, and then the people have been uh, food and have been brainwashed by the media and the left left wing party and uh, and uh, Antifa. Yeah, it's like, you know, uh, some people may have done, done made some mistakes, but uh, in life, but they they have been like either been uh, leaders or like they have been said to uh, done some done done a lot of good in their life. To, then uh so they did more good in life than uh less and they didn't yeah. so it makes it sure maybe like someone like did like a 500 500 uh uh, good, uh, four hundred ninety nine good things, but that uh, they did one that one bad thing. That you don't focus on the bad thing. You don't focus on uh, what kind of good things they did. If if you were like one of those uh, people who like support like these people just tear taking be beheading statues or like you know like. Vandalizing in places and uh, in the name of like maybe George, in the name of George Floyd, uh, Ahmed Arbery, Breonna Taylor, Jacob Blake, or like, or like basically like anyone who's like basically not religious, and you 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 just because it doesn't they don't fit your agenda that you all hate these people. Or maybe you're an atheist and like you're going on all like psycho crazy. That did not give you the right to like they like, like, did that in there. Now they were there for a reason. And if I see like the people like worshiping like a statue of like ah uh, like you know uh, criminals and such. And I'm not talking about like about uh, be like a you know, slave owner. Like, come on, there are like people who are like actually uh, here, like who actually sort of, you know, did a lot of good things in the in the area they they uh, lived in. Or they helped start something. And so, if you really like, support these these bad people. We can't be friends.
people should have learned from this uh, at least once and yeah now they're doing, not doing, doing, doing it again oh god so this is my message for people so 2020 has been like, a, like one of the worst years that we've ever had Coronavirus was a month of them as at, was at its peak. Black Lives Matter started again. Antifa got started, and and social media got all psycho. And the same with the news. People don't want to believe the real, no real news, and would rather want to make show of fake news. Whatever well, they would rather hate each other. So if if you're if you're watching this right now and you feel like oh wait, and if if you found found this uh new, this uh video very upsetting yeah, I'm with, you. I'm with you. Because I I know some people might be atheist or like they don't have, believe in like a religion or maybe they believe in another religion but that does not mean you know. We can, we'll, that does not give us the right to hate on others because of it. Let's just hope Justin Trudeau actually does, like, does something about this because this has gone far, on far enough. Mm. And then Donald Trump's probably pissed off because, uh, because of the people were like, you know, banning like the Senate, the Senate, the American Senate, that like the remembrance the <laughs> for fallen soldiers. Yeah. Why can't just people just pay their respects?